centuries later, science continues to investigate difficult questions every day. Yet even with brilliant minds worldwide, we still don't have all of the answers. In fact, some people might argue that we're just now learning to ask the truly big questions. Here is the list of top 10 questions that science still cannot answer. Question number 1, Does God exist? According to science the universe came into existence due to Big Bang, 13.7 billion years ago, but scientists were unable to reveal that why Big Bang happens they are still perplexed about how living organism come into existence from non-living matter. But the question remains the same is there any individual who created all the stuff? Question number 2, Why do we sleep? As far as we know, virtually every creature on earth enjoys a good night's rest as much as people do. So obviously sleep must serve a key purpose for all living things, right? Well, it turns out science doesn't have a clue. Question number 3, Why do we dream? Dreams are basically stories and images our mind creates while we sleep. Dreams can be vivid. They can make you feel happy sad, or scared. There are many theories about why we dream, but no one knows for sure. Some researchers say dreams have no purpose or meaning and are nonsensical activities of the sleeping brain. Others say dreams are necessary for mental, emotional, and physical health. Question number 4 What happen after we die? Scientist defines death as clinical death, when heart stops pumping blood and biological death, when all the organs and cells of body shut down but no one knows what happens or where we go after death. Question number 5 What is universe made of? Atom that we see all around is only 5% of the universe but scientists are unable to tell about the other 95% which the universe is made of. They believe that it's made of dark matter. Question number 6 What is dark energy? The universe is expanding, and that's getting faster all the time. We say that the cause of the acceleration is dark energy, but what is it? Right now, we don't really have any idea. The hypothesis is rather ad hoc, and is an attempt to account for the increasing speed of the universe's expansion. In practical terms, it works like anti-gravity. Question number 7 What are the boundaries of the universe? The universe is expanding which we've known for a while. But where is, or what is, the boundary? We can only see a part of the universe, the so-called observable universe, which goes on for 46.5 billion light years in all directions. However, we can only interact with things inside of 16 billion light years. Question number 8 What is inside a black hole? A black hole has a boundary, where gravity is just strong enough to drag light back, and prevent it escaping. Because nothing can travel faster than light, everything else will get dragged back also. Astronomers have extensive knowledge of black holes but still they are unable to tell what is inside a black hole. Some physicists believe that they are doors to some other universe. Question number 8 What is inside a black hole? A black hole has a boundary, where gravity is just strong enough to drag light back, and prevent it escaping. Because nothing can travel faster than light, everything else will get dragged back also. Astronomers have extensive knowledge of black holes but still they are unable to tell what is inside a black hole. Some physicists believe that they are doors to some other universe. Question number 10 What is music and why we have it? Why should we find pleasure in listening to various combinations of vibrations at differing frequencies? Why did people develop this ability to create it? And what purpose does it serve? One hypothesis is that it aids with sexual reproduction, much like a peacock's tail. But as of yet, this is only a hypothesis, not a theory.